Just as the lymph nodes are responsible for filtering lymphatic fluid, the spleen is in charge of filtering the bloodstream. The spleen is an organ located in the left upper quadrant. Does anyone remember at what rib level it lies? It typically lies between the left 9th and 11th rib. This is an important point to keep in mind. If you ever have a patient that shows up with some sort of abdominal or posterior trunk trauma to that region, the spleen is broken down into sections of sinusoids. Just like lymph nodes, there is a surrounding fibrous capsule. Blood filters into the spleen via arteries and leaves via the veins. This white section is called white pulp and contains follicles with embedded B cells similar to lymph nodes. So if B cells are predominantly found in the follicles, it would stand to reason that these numerous follicles are responsible for a majority of producing what immunologic proteins in our bodies? Yeah, IgM antibody production. Periarterial lymphatic sheaths, or PALs, contain T cells that surround arteries within the white pulp. Blood eventually trickles into the red pulp, where macrophages mechanically filter out senescent RBCs, cellular inclusions, and pathogens. Bacteria with capsules are normally destroyed by the IgM released from the spleen. Do you know what some of these encapsulated bacteria are? They can be remembered with the mnemonic Shine Skis, and this stands for Streptococcus pneumoniae, Haemophilus influenza, Neisseria meningitidis, E. coli, Salmonella, Klebsiella pneumoniae, and Streptococcus agalactiae. However, if there is trauma to the spleen, or someone has sickle cell disease and auto infarcts their spleen, Lack of IgM will allow encapsulated bacteria to proliferate and disseminate throughout the body, causing massive trouble, including septic shock. These patients need to be vaccinated annually as they are much more susceptible to pneumonia and flu. A sign of splenic dysfunction, or loss, is the presence of these types of red blood cells on a peripheral blood smear. What are these inclusions called? And why are they there? They are called Howell Jolly bodies. And what are they? Right, they are the nuclear remnants from immature RBCs. Normally, the spleen is supposed to filter out this material. Flash quiz time. What types of bacteria are targeted by the spleen? encapsulated bacteria. Again, you can remember them using the Shineskys mnemonic that stands for Streptopneumo, Haemophilus influenza, Neisseria, E. coli, Salmonella, Kleb, and Strep.